Hello, everyone, and welcome to NASCAR's Studio 3. I'm Jonathan Mamron, joined by Steve O'Donnell. Steve, how are you? I'm doing well. Thanks for having me on. All right, let's jump right in here. 2019 Aero Package, we've had a, a pretty good sample size so far. What are you guys impressed with? With What do you guys like that you're seeing out of this, uh, this race package? Yeah, I think all in all, you know, you look at something uh, from an eye test standpoint, and then you say, you know, directionally, that looked really good. And then you look at the facts, and, and you hope those match up. And... What we've seen really for each one of our races is a, a much better product on the track. When you look at kind of green flag lead changes, I think we've seen somewhere in the neighborhood of a 44%, 45% increase uh, year over year, which is tremendous. So directionally, really like what we're seeing and, and really like the competition on the track. Let's talk about some of those moments. I mean, Texas was a super competitive race. My mind immediately jumps to, to Bristol in that stage one end. How has this package kind of aided, you know, moments like that? Yeah, you look at, I think, two things first, like Bristol and, and a particularly, you know, unbelievable race on the short track. And candidly, that was going to be a little bit of a concern for us. We, we put this together for the intermediates, hoped it would, would uh, deliver on the short tracks, and, and Bristol certainly checked that box. And then Las Vegas, one of our first uh, kind of two true tests on the intermediate track was great. And then as you kind of went to Texas from there, Teams had a little bit of a chance to, to catch up after the West Coast swing, like we'll see after the break here to, to make some adjustments. And I think you'll see some, some more competitive teams also. As we look ahead to, to Kansas and then pass that to the 600, these guys have been home for quite a while and been mm -hmm. able to work on this stuff. So what can we see or expect to see on track uh, with those two races? Yeah, I think from our perspective, uh, we hope to see a lot more of that. When you see any new rules package, uh, historically, you always see one or two teams really hit on it. Uh, out of the gate, which we've seen certainly with Penske and Joe Gibbs Racing, but you know you started to see some other teams knocking on the door in Texas. Now with even some more downtime, you know Hendrick needs a win, Stuart Haas needs a win, Roush is up there as well, RCR. So I think all those teams have gone to work, are going to learn a bit, a little bit more. Even JTG, you know, you're seeing them run really well, especially at Richmond. So uh, those teams are going to get up there, and we expect them to win some races as well. 